What's up guys, Ryan here. Now, a lot of people ask me how to increase their KDP sales. And while I can't give you a guarantee way, I can assure you that sales start with visibility in search results. Now, are you doing everything you can do to position yourselves in front of potential customers looking for the books that you're selling? If you're not advertising, the answer to that question is no. Now, if you wanna say, well, I don't have time to run ads, hey, I can relate. I can relate, I can relate, I can relate to that 100%. It's not easy, it's time consuming, it's a pain. But that has officially changed. There's a tool that I wanna show you today called Merch Amigo. And it is so easy to use, it's gonna blow your mind. So I've got it installed right now. Uh, the Chrome extension icon is a little like, I don't know if it's like Mexican or what, but it's like a little beanie that you would see uh, probably in Mexico with the colors. and. The way it works is once you have the Chrome extension installed and you have a license, you'll see this extra like bar injected into your KDP account. And by the way, it also works on Amazon Merch. I'm gonna show you at the end of this video something that will blow your mind if you have access to AMS through Amazon Merch. Now that's the kicker. You have to have that little invite code and have used it back when it was available, which I know a lot of people didn't take advantage of myself included because my AMS account was through Vendor Central, so I didn't think I needed it, but now that Merch Amigo is available, I'm wishing that I had just used the invite code. Um, but anyways, it still works for KDP and every KDP seller gets access to AMS. So you'll notice right here, it says budget $1, bid five cents. Now I went and keyed those values in manually. And what I'm saying is when Merch Amigo creates an ad for me, I'm setting a daily budget of $1, and a cost per click bid of five cents. Now we can actually click settings here and we can exclude the subtitle, which I think is a good idea because Merch Amigo sets up automatic targeting ads. So if your subtitle is full of relevant keywords, you would not want to check this box. I typically don't always put a lot of relevant keywords in there. A lot of times it's just like generic product description. That's usually how I structure my titles. So I'm excluding the subtitles there. Uh, daily budget, $1 is what I feel comfortable with. If I'm running a lot of these, that way I know I won't run up too big of a bill. Default bid, I think you can go as low as like two cents, but remember, like if you bid too low, you're not gonna get any visibility. Visibility is a function of people competing to show up on those keywords that the customer searched. So the more the better, but also understand your margins like kdp margins are typically pretty slim for the low content no content books that's what i'm selling a lot of so my bid is quite low but also will not like allow me to throw away a lot of money on clicks that don't lead to sales so figure out what works for you over time you can adjust this obviously uh you can also set up an ad group i just called it amigo for merch amigo dynamic bids down only i think is the way to go as far as structuring your bids and then just hit save. Now, this is where your mind's probably gonna be blown. In order to run an ad, this is literally all you have to do. And again, you'll notice this is not standard. What you see right here above me, um, those buttons, those are injected by the Chrome extension, but if I click create US ad, it opens up a new browser tab. Now, it doesn't even lose focus from the browser tab I'm looking at, but what happens over here is it autofills my campaign name with the uh, name of the book, which by the way, I had to use some of my web developer skills to blur out like the book covers, keep my niches private. Uh, I also blurred out the campaign name and uh, the products here so that, you know, I'm not just like putting it all out there, but it autofills the campaign name with relevant, well, essentially it just uses your book title, but it puts that in there for you automatically. It sets your budget automatically. Uh, sets the bid strategy automatically and sets your default bid down here. The only thing you have to do then is come down here and click create campaign. And that's it guys. Once you click create campaign, you'll get an email instantly from AMS saying it's under review and you should get an approval email within a day or two from them. And then your ad is eligible to be uh, served to potential customers on Amazon. Now, again, it's going to come down to a function of like, have you spent your whole budget? If not, is your bid high enough versus other people competing on the same keywords, et cetera. But this is a great way of getting initial visibility to your products because guys, like I always say, if people don't see your products, there's no chance of them buying them. Now, I also real quick want to uh, show you that 
Merch Amigo also works for <laughs> Amazon Merch. Now, again, I did not personally take advantage of Amazon Merch's invite code for AMS because I'm one of like very few people who was in AMS through Vendor Central, which means that like we were running AMS ads to our shirts like before, you know, way before uh, they actually did the public invites. But this is a video out there on YouTube from the Merch Amigo creators showing you how easily you can set up a single ad and this one will blow your mind completely. So they used the manage page on their merch account. And what this lets them do is they can tr click the ad type toggle and then click group ad. And every single one of the products on this page or on your manage page, and you can use filters to do 25, 50, whatever. Um, maybe don't do 100 because you might crash your browser, but he just toggled it 25 and it just opened up ads for all 25 of those products with the right configurations all in one click. And then all you have to do is go to each tab and click launch campaign. And before you know it, you'll have advertisements running for all of your products. How sick is that, guys? Now, I put a link in the description that you can use to come on over to Merch Amigo and start a free trial. You don't even need to pay to use it. So if you click that, it'll take you down to the bottom of the page. All you have to do is put in an email address, a name, and a password, and you can get going for free. But when you're ready to uh, become a paid member, it's only $7.99 a month, and you can save 10% with the coupon code Ryan's method, all one word. So do that, save some money, save some time, increase your visibility, which will help you make more money. It's a win, 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 win. And uh, the last thing that I'm gonna mention before I sign off is that I have a KDP course that will coach you through getting your KDP, no content, low content book business scaled up. Of course, it involves using automation. It's not required, but anytime I can save you time, leading to making more money or just relaxing and doing whatever it is you want to do, I'm going to recommend that. So that's one of the things I cover in the course as well as niche research, designing covers, designing interiors, basically everything I could think of. It's all in here, guys. So thank you for watching this video. If you liked it, do me a favor, hit the like button. If you're not subscribed yet, please hit that subscribe button because I'm going to keep dropping the fire KDP content as well as other e-commerce business uh, content as well. Uh, and that's it, guys. Thank you for watching this video. I'll see you at the next one. Passive Income School is open. Enroll now at ryansmethod.com. Thank you.